This episode of Falcon Dagger is proudly sponsored by Dice Envy. We love their dice. The quality and the designs are top notch and they offer resin, metal, stone, and wood dice. If you'd like to cop some for yourself, I recommend getting the Edge Boss dice. It's my favorite set and I use it every time I play. Check them out at www.diceenvy.com slash perilous and use promo code perilous to save 10% off your order. And now on with the show. Welcome back to Perilous Storytelling. Our adventurers are standing on the precipice of a structure holding secrets, surprises, and sinister uh, snakes. There's going to be snakes. I, I don't know. So a half-elf bird, cat, and giant armored enigma walk into an evil wedding cake. Let's play. An evil wedding right. cake? <laughs> That's what a ziggurat is. A ziggurat is like a giant evil wedding cake. And I couldn't you think of like a tagline. It doesn't have to be I don't, there's, There be. might be snakes. Maybe I'll put snakes in here. I just wanted to, you know, give the audience a little bit of, huh? All right, like roll perception every room we walk in, guys. <laughs> every just, room. just in case we see a slippery, snaky snake. Just in case there's any invisible snakes. Oh, great. Now they're invisible. You all are standing to the opened door of the ziggurat. Um, it is made of a black, uh, almost shiny stone. Uh, there are two tor torch holders in front. Uh, they are uh, of the door that has <laughs> slopped open that have kind of like exited and have lit themselves. They're not really torches. They're like magical crystals almost that kind of light the front, uh, letting this kind of eerie orange glow permeate the area. Um, and you're all just standing in front of it. Um, the last time uh, Avery, I believe, had taken the... You guys had taken the crystal out of the sword and used it to open the door? Yeah, he got he got a mill distance, friend. Yeah. yeah. I got my own. All right. We got something to deal oh, with. Everybody right has now, one except the uh, sad machine. That's crazy. <laughs> uh, I am it's going like you're to your own demon. point at Kinnick and say, "We're in the middle of something. You're going to fix this later." I no and then I grab, I grab. I want to grab the broadsword and sling it across my back or wherever I can fit it, because I guess it's important now. <laughs> And before descending into the wedding cake, I want to take a brief pause, pull something out, pull a dagger out of my inventory, and I would like to whip that as far into the like murky, swampy woods as I possibly can. Do I want to, should you I want to just strength? throw a dagger as far as you I, can? I'm a very specific dagger now that I have a middle distance friend. <laughs> I'm going to roll strength really quick. I roll a six. It's not going very far. You know what? No, I'm. Or all the 12. Okay. Only determines how many spins it does. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Yeah, it, still, it, does <laughs> it does only three rotations and it gets stuck in a tree about, I want to say, 15 feet away. It whips through the air and hits like a, a tree in the swamp. I sigh. That's fine. I remove the sex dagger from my inventory. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the sex knife is gone. <laughs> All righty. I hope a random NPC later is like, oh, you dropped this. <laughs> I don't want it. Let's go into the wedding cake. All righty. Descending into the ziggurat is very confusing. As you go down the staircase, it almost feels like you are you can't tell if you're going up or down. It's almost MC Escher-like as you head down into the stairs. Uh, the altitude shifts and the stairs almost seem to stop in random places and go back up. But finally, you reach a landing area of sorts. It is a black stone room with orange crystals lining the wall, giving it a slight uh, glowing tinge. Um, on the floor is just random rubble and debris. Uh, it seems as if uh, the the, la the thick layer of dust uh, tells you that nobody has entered here for, for quite some time almost, except for a trail of footprints that lead directly in front of you. To your left, you can see a door. It is an iron wrought door. Um, it has three holes in it um, that seem like they are for the placement of something. To your right, you see a simple wooden door. And directly in front of you, uh, as you step into the room, uh, you hear the swish, swish, swish of four swinging blades uh, leading down a corridor. We should follow the footprints. Hmm. I think we should go through the wooden door first. Why? I want to fight. I don't. Do you want to? Do you think you're di like going to be able to make it through those swinging blades? I, like, Kinnick. I want to turn it off. Kinnick, I walk up to the sw swinging blades. I'm going to use Mage Hand to pull the lever at the end of the hallway. Oh. 
I hope your your mage hand can dance. My mage hand can turn invisible. I'm sure he's a pretty good dancer. What is it? That, what's gonna happen if the mage hand gets fucking chopped? Nothing, right? It's nothing. a mage hand. Yeah, it's a mage hand. It's not like a stand. Oh yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to think of what you would probably acrobatics with your mage hand. Okay, I can do that. Well, I rolled a twenty-four. Very good Ooh. dancer. <laughs> As your mage hand gets to the end, missing all the swinging blades, it touches the lever and it stops. Like the mage hand stops? Yeah, it stops. It tries to pull it down. It, you can see a concerted effort, uh, but the lever does not ka-chunk go down. Bird, why aren't you pulling it down? It's a heavy lever, and I'm kind of out of it right now, Sad Machine. Why are I you just out of out, it? I walk over to the wooden Don't door and open it. it. <laughs> the door opens, and there is a simple wooden chest flanked by two stone statues. Oh, oh. God. The wooden chest has no visible lock on it. Cool. Um, I go I in. No. <laughs> Sad Machine, I, I'm wait. I'm in already. Sad Machine, wait, please. A treasure. Wait, don't touch it. I'm in the middle of the room right in front of the treasure. Please, please don't touch it. Why? Uh, look at the statues. They're ominous. Just let him. They are very ominous. Just let him. Sad machine needs what do a they middle look distance, like? what, friend. What, what, whatever, do whatever you want in there, and I the, step out the of the two room. Statues, the two statues look like um, simple soldiers with uh, like leather helmets, and they are holding swords pointed towards the chest. They beckon. What what is it? the chest is just a normal ass chest? Just a normal ass chest. Do they have eyes? Like uh, you know, stone eyes or something? No, they are just like they are they are crude stone statues that seem to have weathered with time. Uh their faces are not perceptible at all. Like they're they're like you know when you go to like a museum and you see an old statue and the face is completely weathered away and it's smooth like okay. you're playing a PlayStation One game. Yeah. Yeah. I... Just like that. Well, nobody's gonna help. I'm just gonna look in the treasure. The sad machine is interested. Uh, he oh, opens the. Help me. He peeks. He peeks. He peeks. Roll for initiative. You have unlocked a mimic that pops up with gnarly teeth as it starts to hiss at you and it jumps towards you. Roll for initiative. You have entered combat. The two statues also turn towards you with a fluid motion, teeth appearing on their face. Ah! I rolled a 19. I'm gonna die. 21. Oh, wait, are we all rolling initiative? Okay. Well, yes. Yeah, I was, I was going to say I closed the door so we didn't actually know. <laughs> uh, uh, I rolled an 8. There we go. Turn order is set. It is Bird's turn. Bird Great. knows about this? I don't know. I, um... Door's closed. <laughs> door's closed. That's my... I'm, I'll delay my turn. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah, you machine. Know. It's your turn. So how angry do they look? So the chest is snarling with teeth with a big red funny mouth and a scary tongue. And the two statues now also have giant gaping mouths where their faces were. You know, like a lamprey eel. Their faces look like a lamprey eel. I'm, I'll walk back. Oh boy, hey. David. <laughs> what? Did he not just trigger attack of opportunity? Did I? Oh yeah, give me a second. Fuck! <laughs> three of them, David. <laughs> Dude, you almost got away with it as well. If if Avery wasn't fucking on the ball, <laughs> what the would fuck, Avery? Noticed. Dude, well, I figured Brendan would have noticed that. I didn't think I was screwing you over. I haven't used a dungeon properly in so long. So, yeah. Set <laughs> machines in it. Three attacks of opportunity. She's gonna die. <laughs> I gotta get now. I gotta go, go find my D eight. Oh shit. This is my like I really didn't scream for help as his first move. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you're too lax about combat. I warned y'all. Yeah, I hope right. you realize how low my health is. Oh my god. The uh, mimic in front of you, the chest, whips out its tongue. Uh, it is a. It turns into like a club as it whips it out and just smacks you across the face, dealing seven damage. Ow! All right, and then I... is. Yeah, you can still, you can, it's an oh, attack yeah. of opportunity, you took the damage, but you can still act. It is now your turn. I, okay, well, I I guess I opened the door. Kenick! <laughs> Fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> and it's I like guess I'm stuck there because you're right in front of the door. 
Are you gonna attack or do something in your turn, or are you just gonna walk and open the door? Is that like... Is that my- is that a bonus slapped. action? What do you mean is that- what, what do you think your action was? What is your action? What action did you take, David? Getting hit. That's what? <laughs> <laughs> you know what, fuck it. Fire Machine thinks that is action. That's his action. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're gonna die. It's the fucking- it's their turn next. Yeah, fine, it's, fine. It's, I, 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 he, no, I delay. I, I, I nah. only wanted to delay my turn once. He turns around, readies his longbow, and fires. Okay, which mimic are you firing at? Uh, the one who attacked me, so the middle one. Okay, so the chest, the chest mimic. Got it. Uh, how much damage you do, you do hit? Uh, I've done a, I've done a twenty-two, and I've done a seven piercing damage. Okay, and do you have extra attack? I do know that. I remember now. Okay. Ready my bow once more. Go again. I do a 24 okay. and I hit for 10. Okay, so you hit the, you fire in quick 17. succession two arrows that pierce the top of the uh, chest mimic's mouth, um, dealing 17 damage. All right, it is now one of the statue's turns. He turns towards you, Sad Machine, and gets up onto your uh, side uh, while you are cowering in front of the door. Uh, his sword turns into what can only be assumed is some sort of spiny sea creature. And what is your AC? It's 15. And it hits. Fuck! Oh. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna roll a new character tonight, ain't I? It hits for four damage. The 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 sword sea creature uh, slams down at you, its spines penetrating your armor, uh, dealing four damage. Kill it! Now it is the other one's turn. Oh, God. And he just decides to be a basic bitch and swing his sword directly at you. And he hits. <laughs> you open the door. <laughs> <laughs> see you getting fucking everybody's here. Everybody in the other room is just staring me down as I get oh, no. beat the fuck Bird up. is laughing. <laughs> <laughs> he swings his sword down, slicing open your front bless breastplate, uh, leaving a shallow wound for five damage. Wait, what health are you on? Bird! <laughs> he said ten health. I'm so I'm Christ. really low. That was. I would more like than to take my delayed turn now. <laughs> yeah, you can take your delayed turn. Yes. <laughs> okay. Cool. I am going to step into the door frame. I don't know why Sad Machine didn't move out of the room. <laughs> but I'm going to step step into the. I'm going to step into the doorway, and uh, I would like to use my rapier to attack the the left statue the one that just hit sad machine <laughs> okay sad machine looks i would like to imagine sad machine looks up to bird and he just has a, a fucking swollen ass just every yeah, his whole face sad machine's uh, fucked up uh, oh i only rolled a 10 <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> you miss with your rapier. It skims off of the mimic oh, as if it is no. slashing at stone. Well, right. well, sorry about that, Sad Machine. I use my bonus action to take the disengage action and I backflip over to Oh my god. god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, sorry. Wait, D David, do you realize he could have just walked past you, past yeah. Kinnick? Like, he wouldn't have done an attack of opportunity on you or something. <laughs> No, I know. I, he wouldn't have, Probably. Though. Sad Machine would not have done that. He's too polite. <laughs> he wouldn't have passed yeah, you. I'm yeah. sure that's going to work out real well for him. <laughs> it's fine. This is role-playing. Kenick, it is now your turn. It's Learn my it. turn? Oh, my fucking God. Uh, this is a really bad, like... What's my cone? Imagine if Sad Machine had walked out of the room and the guy with the cone attack was the one in the <laughs> <laughs> Just go into the room, though. He can't hit all of them without hitting you. He physically can't, David. <laughs> yeah, bro, let me just, like, use my burning hands right over the top of you. Let's see what happens. I'll put my hands on my shoulders. Yeah, I'll put my shoulders. Oh, yeah, put my your, shoulders. I'll, yeah I'll, put, I'll put my hands on your shoulders and, like, put my hands in opposite directions. It still won't hit the two on either side of him, though. Yeah, I know. Well, but it's burning hands, and I have two hands, Avery, surely. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Like, He's gonna make a semicircle wait, motion. Finally, I'm gonna make the cross. Um, <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Are you wait? Are you actually doing that? Are you getting no, like that's that's bullshit. Okay, I, that's not. That, I can't. I don't think I can do that. <laughs> That'd be changing. It's theater the of the mind. Time. You can do um, whatever you want. <laughs> 
I'm going to fuck. What is, what would be a all right, Brendan? This is this is gonna be for you. I'm gonna cast fear <laughs> on. Um, <laughs> Are you gonna cast fear gonna, on m- m- where I am? Uh, yeah, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to do a wisdom saving throw. Oh my um, god, sad machine's gonna piss his pants. <laughs> uh, so I'm casting fear. It's a okay. cone of thirty feet, so I think that hits everybody in the room. That hits everybody. Yep. Um, what is your spell DC? So this what do they so have to bad. be? Fifteen. Fifteen. Okay, I will roll three times, and then David also. No, I rolled an eleven. <laughs> Oh my god. What do I say? What I is, can't believe Sad Machine is about to get killed on the first turn of combat. <laughs> what is Sad Machine seeing? I mean, Probably everything machine, around what's, him. What's Sad Machine's <laughs> worst fear? Sad, yeah. Sad Machine actually, there's nothing different. He just actually realizes how fucked he is. And he's like, ah! okay, uh, I'm rolling. I'm just trying to remember how to. Okay, there we go. I'm he looks down to into his cockroach bag and every cockroach is, has like bird's face on it. Fucking horrifying. So the one that had the last one that attacked David is feared. The two that attacked David are feared. And then I have to roll the chest one. That one is also you hit all three of them with fear. What is uh what <laughs> does fear four. do? Oh, they all, all four. They, they they all run away from me in the most direct furthest like way, and they do that for three turns. Oh no! Oh, oh no! <laughs> oh. Dude, why? Why? <laughs> That means I run to I, I I run towards the mimic and I start holding they, it. They also drop whatever they're holding. Uh, okay, they drop. They, they, his they, bow? they do not. They do not drop anything because everything is a part of their body. I dropped my uh, bow. Move away from you by the safest available route on each of its turns, unless there is nowhere to move. If the creature ends its turn in a location where it doesn't have line of sight, this you, the is going to kill me. Make a wisdom saving throw on a successful save. Can Spell you actually there's something you can there's something you can do here that will make this a really I'm good play. Also walking forwards. There we go. Over, <laughs> over, <laughs> over Savage. Uh, I, I walk past Savage. Yeah. Do I so, do what do we move right now? Uh, we swap places. No, okay? it's during that? it's during your turn, right? But yeah. Um, it's during my turn. Yeah, I think so. Okay. My bow is on the ground. I can't do anything. I'm literally going to be in the corner of the other room just crying <laughs> for the entire encounter. That's better than dying. <laughs> it is. Okay, so they are all they all run to the back of the room. Uh, and they all turn their faces away from you to try to like like they're just they're just touching the wall trying to find some crevice they could escape from. Yeah. Oh my god. All right, it is now the chest one's turn. I'm going to make a saving throw. Uh it fails. Uh it continues to panic. It is now Brickhouse's turn. I am stepping into the doorway. <laughs> stepping over Sad Machine. <laughs> and I'm attacking the mimic on the top. Okay. Um, 11. It misses. Uh, I think you have extra attack, though. I do. I say shit and swing again. Okay. Um, you swing your sword twice at the mimic on the top. It just. The first attack just skids off of it. Um,. The second attack does slice into it, dealing 13 damage. I'm happy with this. I see one's afraid already, so I'm not bothering to smite. I don't think they're that dangerous now. Okay, uh, we're rolling back up. It is now starting at the top of the order. It is Bird's turn. Great. Bird just mutters to himself, oh, you shut the fuck up, I'll show you. <laughs> and he runs back into the room, <laughs> and he goes to the other side, the opposite statue that the, that Brick attacked, and he thrusts his rapier into it. And can I attempt a sneak attack, if this counts as a Yeah, because his yeah, back it's, is turned. Back yeah. Is turned. It's a, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oop. I roll a 26 to hit. Okay, it definitely hits. I roll 19 damage. You begin to expertly thrust your rapier into the statue mimic that is on the lower the the right side of the room uh piercing its stone shell over and over again into the meaty juices inside sad machine it is now your turn i'm not done yet okay oh 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 oh, oh, all right i said and i muttered to myself again yeah how about that fucker i disengage and i move one step back (laughs) Yeah, look what it's going to do when its back's turned and it's cowering in fear. <laughs> I'm not fucking talking to you, Kenick. Me turn. Y- you only have one move. <laughs> and that's running the fuck away from me. That's not true. I, uh, can, I have a wisdom save, save, right? Yeah. Uh, not while you're in line of sight of me. Oh, this is going to suck because I have 60 feet. 
I run. <laughs> run once you leave others. line of sight, can you make the wisdom save? Uh, yeah. So like, if you're, I guess if you're facing. Can I away, can I see him I if know. I'm at the edge of the other room? Hey, you can say we close the door. You can say you close the door. Sure, I close the door, <laughs> and then I I crawl I crawl into the corner and I start crying, which is a lot of it's wisdomy, I guess. It's very. I do wise. a wisdom save. I rolled a five. Nice. You yeah, you pass. do not pass. You are still scared. <laughs> um. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, the statue mimic on the right side of the room fails and it is still scared. It looks like it has pissed itself somehow. The statue on the left side of the room, same thing. They both piss themselves simultaneously. <laughs> oh. And Kennick, it is now your turn. Now, uh, I believe so much piss in is this episode. fear of concentration. Do, why haven't it, I can cast cantrips or will that break it? Yes, I believe so. I believe you can still. Um, okay, so casting another spell doesn't break your concentration unless the second spell requires it. Okay. So you can hold your you can hold your concentration unless uh, right. cantrip or spell requires your concentration. Which Eldritch Blast does not. Okie dokie. So I'm going to walk backwards slightly to the door. Um, and I'm going to cast spell on the right one. I hit. Uh, I, well, I don't hit. Sorry. Probably not. Yeah, uh, it is It is an 11. You oh. fire your Eldritch Blast towards it and it gets off right up above it into the wall. It looks backwards at you real quick and goes, and then turns back to the wall, scrambling again, trying to find some crack to seep through. It's so easy to hit them when they're running away and facing Shut the wall. The fuck huh? up. Right. It's a projectile. <laughs> it's the chest mimic's turn. I just whisper uh, myself, the chest all in the wrist, all in the wrist. The chest mimic is still afraid, so it is now Brickhouse's turn. I'm hitting the same one I hit before. This feels Sick. like bullying at this point. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you hit for 13 damage. I swing again. <laughs> and the second attack misses. Your first sword strikes and just a little like piece out of it almost. And then the second strike just skids <laughs> off of the piece that you kind of carved out of. No! <laughs> Alrighty, and the turn order is reset. It is Bird's turn now. I look Kinnick in the eye and I maintain eye contact. I pull out a throwing knife and I throw it at the one in the corner. Uh, which corner? Left corner or right corner? It doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, you're, th you're throwing oh knife. You're throwing knife. Goes to the crit failed. Failed. ground. Absolutely <laughs> crit failed. Dude. Your throwing knife flies through the air and the butt of it hits the, uh, the mimic that you were aiming at and it clatters to the ground. <laughs> the mimic starts crying. Yeah, how about that, Kinnick? Wow, so <laughs> impressive. <laughs> like you said, it's all in the wrist. Uh, sad machine, it is now your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Wisdom save is six. Are you fucking shitting? Dude, I'm rolling. I'm rolling. I, I'm, I think my pants are fucking pissed now. <laughs> I think at the end of this turn, the fear will subsist because you're out yeah. of line of sight and out of the out of the 30 feet zone. Out so. of yeah. sight and out of mind. See, I'm bringing it yeah, back. At, at end of this turn, the fear will go away without a uh, without a wisdom saving throw. So, um. Failing again, it is now the statue that Avery hit with the handle of a knife. I'm rolling. <laughs> I like to and think I didn't it hit it at all. And it shakes itself with the ah, fear, fuck. turns around, looks at Bird, looks down at the ground at the dagger, looks back up at Bird, moves forward, and swings with its uh, weird fish spine creature sword. Uh, what is Bird's AC? Bird's AC is uh, 15. Ah, it is a critical fail. It just completely whiffs at you. It, it, it swings the sword and then it like almost completely spins its torso around and then spins it all the way back around. Looks at its sword, looks back at you and goes, huh. It's all the wrist. The other statue is uh, still afraid, but I believe that ends this turn. And now it is Kenick's turn again. Okay. Um, I'm going to try and use Eldritch Blast on the one that just swung it. Um, bird. I rolled a 17 to hit. It does hit. You fire your Elf Blast and it just sears the whole front of the stone soldier, uh, giving a pleasant, almost cooked meat smell somehow. It does 13 damage, so. Yes. All righty. After Kennick, it is the chest mimic's turn. Uh, it is unafraid at the end of its turn here. So now it is Brickhouse's turn. I sigh and raise my longsword again. Preparing to hit the one in the corner. 
I'm having flashbacks being punished by my father. I roll. <laughs> what the fuck? First one what? hits. What the fuck? I attack again. Second one hits, so 16 damage. Okay, the one in the corner is definitely bloodied. You swing your sword twice, expert mode, cutting off one of its arms, and it grows back, but it grows back a lot wimpier, and uh, it, it is bleeding profusely from orifices you didn't even know existed on statues. Mm. I'm learning a lot. <laughs> You're learning a lot about a lot about meat statues. You're gonna be prepped to play Golden Light, uh, Bird. I would like to stab it with my rapier, if that is all right. Yeah, absolutely. I roll 26. Yep, it is a hit. That's all I got. All right. It is definitely bloodied now. Both statues are in the bloodied state. Um, Sad Machine, and it's your I turn. I use my bonus action. Brendan. Yeah, oh, sorry. <laughs> I was about to. I, I, use my, I use my bonus action to once again flip over Kinnick and get behind him in Brick House in the corner. <laughs> I'm providing moral. Bitch. I am providing moral support. <laughs> All right, Sad Machine, it is now your turn. You're no longer afraid. I'm you are no afraid longer it? afraid as well, yep. Oh, that's good. I can. He stops screaming. He is looks his at action? his cockroaches. Oh. Where's my bow? He goes Did you back leave to your the... bow in the roof? Yeah, because he dropped yeah, it. Yeah, because I, I dropped it. Oh, yeah. it. oh, yeah, you dropped your weapon. <laughs> he opens the door. He looks on the ground. It was, it, it was in the middle of the room, right? It was. <laughs> Now there's fucking mimic blood on it. Shit. Uh, what can I do? Probably going in your bow. I don't, I'm not going in. <laughs> I have too little health. That's a good point. Close Sad the door. machine. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Sad machine takes his celestial synth and plays a beautiful melody, gathering swarm. And I'm gonna. Can I distract? The, what can I do with the Gathering Swarm, even? Mage Hand to grab your bow. I do I have- wait, do I have you Mage have, Hand? You have I don't a bug Mage Hand. Everyone has Mage Hand. Oh. Okay. Everyone Actually, that's a better I idea. I do. That's a better idea. I didn't even know I had it. Uh, Sad Machine uses Mage Hand and tries to, like, grab the bow on the ground. Uh, is that an action? I'm guessing it is. Yeah, I mean, that would be- yeah, that would be- that's fine. You, like picking up an item, so I think that'd be an action, unless you have a bonus action or something you could use. Uh, the sad machine does a jig. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't have a bonus action. Yeah, Mage Hand, Mage Hand uses one action, so. Okay, yeah. Um, you can do it, guys. The you close the door chest after mimic. That? Yeah, <laughs> yeah I close the door afterwards. Dude, I fucking <laughs> slam the door. <laughs> All right, the statue mimic that Bird had been attacking is going to move up uh, next to Kennick and swing with its weird fish sword. Right. Um, I'm guessing a 17 is a hit. Uh, yeah, my uh, AC is 11. It swings its fish sword at you and just sticks it in your arm. Kind of, kind of moves it around and jiggles it around a little bit and then pulls it out. Ah. All right, that's what you get. <laughs> master class. Uh, the Thank statue you. mimic in front of Brick is about to attack. Okay, it swings its sword at you and it just completely whiffs it, leading into Kenick's turn. Okay, I'm just going to, well, we'll see if this hits first and then we'll decide what I do. Okay, I put my hand up to its chest and uh, use my Eldritch Blast on the uh, one that just attacked me. And it does okay. seven damage. All righty. Your Eldritch Blast pierces directly through it, leaving a gooey gaping hole. Uh, however, it still stands. You are horrified by what the insides of a mimic look like, and you hope you'll never have to experience it again. Describe it to me. Uh, it's like a pulsating, jellied meat and green mass. Oh, rations. Oh. All right. Uh, it is now the chest mimic's turn. It pops up, and it is it is pretty angry about the treatment of its brother, and attacks you, Kenick. Oh, God. This is the first word. Da, 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 this is a wedding Does a 14 cake. hit? We're going to die. Uh, 11 AC, so yeah. Yeah! So people listening can't see how big this fucking map is. We're going to die. Seven damage. <laughs> the the chest, uh, its tongue, it turns into a needle, and it slides. It quickly slaps forward like a frog grabbing a fly and pierces through your shoulder before... Like, almost get over here, kind of scorpion, uh, moving it out of your shoulder and back into its mouth. Ah! Fuck you, bird! <laughs> Alright, it is now Brick's turn. 
I continue my assault in the corner. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, first one hits. And I roll again. Second oh, one does no. not hit. I think my arm's getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> you swing your sword once again towards the stone mimic, and the first hit lodges directly into its uh, waist, and then as you pull it out and go for another strike, uh, slick with blood, it just skids off of it for the second attack. Uh, the turn order is now reset. It is now Bird's turn. I will try to let you do your bonus action. I will shut up. You're not going to have to worry about it. I'm going to take my... F no, you know what? Yeah, you do got to worry about it. Okay. No, wait. No, you don't. I'm going to Go flat. try and brace on Kinnick's shoulder with one hand and run across the wall to the left in the half space of in the half space that's there across the door and leaping attack the mimic in the corner, the opposite okay. corner of the one that uh, Brick is having an episode in. Attack roll, but also acrobatics roll. You if it. you if you make the acrobatics roll, you can take the advantage. I don't think I made the, it. You don't, okay, you no, him up you did not hand. make it. You, 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 you like, fall directly. You, you fall <laughs> directly on top of Kenning. You put okay, your cool. hand on the shoulder. That can I stand up and that takes up? I, I stand collapse. up. <laughs> I stand up. It takes up the rest of my movement, and I try and hit it with a rapier. <laughs> can I? Yeah, yeah. Earl of 14. It does hit. Which one are you attacking? Mark it for me. The non, the, the other statue. Okay, the one with the hole in it. Got yeah, it. Yeah, the one with the hole it in it. It is still standing <sighs> as you pierce it with your rapier. Fucking what? Uh, but it is it is looking very, 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 very weak. Uh, Kenick is also is knocked prone. Pain. Great. You're welcome. <laughs> Sad Machine, it is your turn. Sad Machine op reopens the door and goes in the doorway. <laughs> Looks at what's happening. All right, that's it. He, I'm gonna uh, use my bonus action to agitate the swarm. Okay. All the cockroaches cling on to my <clears throat> pussy blade. What? That's what Brendan called my blade. I did name it that, yeah. Yeah, I use my pussy blade on the. Uh, that's a statue mimic, right? Mm -hmm. The statue yes, that mimic. Yes, that is a statue pussy. mimic on the right side of the room. Yes. Yeah, that one. I attack. Okay. Hi, Gia. Oops. I accidentally did it twice. I hit. I did twenty five with six dead damage. But uh, you. But, but uh, it's dead. It's dead. But it, I want my bugs. It, it doesn't. It's dead. I want to roll a one d. Let me roll my one d six, please. It's dead. I roll my one d six for bug damage. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. It's dead. You you just kill it immediately with your rapier, and as it falls down, you're like, I'm not done yet, and your bugs swarm all over it. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. I'm not done yet. I what? did it. Yeah, sad machine. Sad machine ends up killing the uh, one of these statue mimics. Um, uh, bonus. <laughs> I close back I the door. I think I had a lot of health, and we haven't fucking touched the actual chest yet. What All right. There, no, that's that that chest it. right there is the is the. I can't remove that from the board. So no, that is no, the I know, mimic. but we haven't. You can. We haven't touched the chest. Oh, that was a mimic. I, if yeah, you take that's its true. health, its health is full. Oh, right. <laughs> that's messed up. We're gonna die. Yeah, probably. Almost All right. Kinnick's prone. How'd that happen? I don't know. I'm gonna use fire hands on the ground. All right. The statue mimic <laughs> that uh, Brickhouse has been attacking uh, swings his sword at him once again. Uh, it is a critical hit. It is a natural 20. Um, oh, God. Uh, yeah, dealing... Uh, <laughs> 11 damage. Oh. It slides its sword at you and strikes cleanly through your blessed your blessed plate. Your breastplate. It could be a blessed plate. Blessed plate, breastplate, whatever. All right. And now it is Kenick's turn once again. Um I stand up. <laughs> <laughs> Standing up, you've lost your movement. You still have an action. Okay. I'm going to use Aldrich Blast on the chest in front of me. I rolled a 20 to hit. Okay, you've done seven damage to it. You fire your blast into it. It comically closes its mouth, goes, and then smoke comes out of its mouth as it opens it again. Did it take damage? Yeah, it took damage. Okay. It hit. <laughs> yeah. Well, it sounds like it ate it. So It ate it, but like in a bad way. Okay. It was too spicy. Uh huh. It's like cramming a ghost pepper in your asshole. That's essentially the like image I want to give. I do know what that's like. Oh. All right, it's the chest mimic's turn. The chest mimic is not going to thank you for this delicious meal. Kenick, it's going to attack you again. This fucking guy. And it misses. Yes, thank fucking God. Mm -hmm. Holy shit. 
shit. It is now Brick's turn once again. I wonder what he'll do. I consider my <laughs> magic and continue my attack on the creature in the corner. <laughs> All right, the first attack hits. I swing again. The second attack does not hit. It is on its fucking absolute final last oh, legs. What? It is <laughs> now <Not> Bird's turn. <laughs> <laughs> it is now Bird's turn. Um, I feel like I've got pretty limited options here. You have a sling. I do, in fact, have a sling. But that is a risk reward weapon, and I don't know if we can afford that right now. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Okay. Them, like a big AOE yes! in a fucking tiny room. It might be. Gosh, it might Jesus be, but Christ. it might not be. Think about it. I would it. like to swing my arbitrary sling at the chest mimic. Because oh, okay, okay. I feel like Brick's done some damage. I, w I wish I was so sure. prone. All right, this is. Oh, well, that's not good. That's a. Deal. I, uh. So now I rolled a hit as well, right? Yes. I sling it. I hit an 11. I don't think it hits the chest. I'm pretty sure that misses. You fire your arbitrary sling and a ghostly skull appears out of it, whiffing above the chest and hitting the wall, turning into uh, just leaving a gooey ectoplasmic trail. I uh, really like to make From note. where it went to where it is. I'm just going to make a quick note. That skull would have done less damage than my rapier. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, shit. I end my turn. Okie dokie. Sad Machine, it is now your turn. <sighs> Sad Machine feels the power, his swarm agitated and all that. He's just fucking going at it. Uh, fuck it. He, he jumps on the fucking corpse of the Mimic and readies his weapon to attack the chest Mimic, attacking Kenick. What? So, okie dokie. What do you mean, what? <laughs> He's attacking the chest mimic. He's not a <laughs> <laughs> I like to imagine Sad Machine is narrating all of this to himself, and Kenick's just like, what? <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens. And Sad Machine talks in third person, too. Take that! Oh, fuck. That 11. is a miss. Oh, darn. I do it again. 23? <laughs> that does hit. You slash hey. at the. You and slash then at the chest mimic the and hit. Swarm. The swarm does an extra six damage, so that's uh, 13. 13. Alrighty, the chest mimic is now bloodied. Holy shit. Alright, and oh the God. let's see, it was Sad Machine's turn. It, it is now the statue mimic's turn. Um, it goes for a grapple on Brick House. You're gonna have to roll a deck save. For this brick, uh, it's going to attempt to grapple and then attack you. I roll a dex of eight. Yep, it spits an adhesive at you, and it's like it's, it's basically like a sticky adhesive, and like crawls up on you. Uh, it is it is embracing you fully, and the lamprey face reaches down and goes for a bite. Somehow it misses a bite, but you are now grappled. Um, it is now Kenick's turn. Right, old faithful. It is. <laughs> yep, on to the next turn. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Eldritch the, Blast is old faithful. The, the chest looking at its brother uh, decides that, man, that would be a really good idea and aims for a grapple on Cack oh, now as well. For fuck's sakes. Am I They're roll brothers? Eight. Dicks. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. They're related. Or a nine. You are sprayed with adhesive and you are now grappled. Right. Um, this, is ending. this is not going to end. Well, rolled a critical I fail on the attack roll. Uh, it misses. <laughs> Thank oh, God. God. Get it off. You get it off. I want to make sad machines right. get it. Uh, Brickhouse, it is now your turn. You can roll a escape roll to get out of the grapple. I will roll my strength to try and break free from it. I roll 18. Yes. You break free easily of the adhesive and the stone soldier falls to the ground. It is I wish pro. to attack it again. Go for it. It's dead. I'll let you decide how you want to kill it. I'll crush. I'll crush it. <laughs> I'll just lay on top of it and you keep it's crushing like, it. I'm so fucking angry. Elbow drop a meaty statue. <laughs> Whoa! I cleaned my room. <laughs> what? what the fuck? Ah, uh, the mimic is now dead. It is turn order again. It's bird's turn. I think about that. I'm instead, I'm going to pull out my rapier, put away this fucking sling, and I would like to check my, check my stance, plant my feet, just a simple thrust with the rapier into the chest mimic. Alrighty. Roll the 24. Oh. It does hit. 
I do nine piercing damage. You slam your rapier into the chest mimic. It pierces it fully from front to back. And as you pull it out, you hear a, just a <laughs> sound. Sad machine, it's your turn. Unless you have a bonus action, Bird. Who cares? <laughs> <laughs> Sad machine is going to do the same thing again. Uses pussy blade. He says that out loud, but he doesn't. <laughs> Roll day <laughs> 26. Alrighty, that hits. the swarm. That's an extra three, so that's a 11 damage. Swinging with your sword, you deal a massive amount of damage to the chest. Somehow, some way, it is still standing. So I do my second attack then. Hi-ya! And it misses. That is, well, it could have been worse. I rolled a one and a two, and my first roll was a two. This stinks! So it would be it was Sad Machine's turn. It is Kenick's turn now. Okay. Kenick, you have to escape from the grapple. Uh, what am I rolling for that? Either strength or dex, whatever you would like. Uh, okay, let me have a look. I'm going to roll dex. I rolled a seven. You are still grappled. Okay, can I do anything? No, you are. You are fully like, you are stuck in there. Um, you are covered in sticky adhesive, so... I can't, like, power up my Eldritch Blast or anything while I'm in there. No, because you would need, um, you would need your mouth free, and your mouth is not free. Uh, okay. God damn it. You're, you would need your mouth or your hands free to make the spell happen, and they are both, wait, you wait, are, wait, like, wait, spider swept tied up. I have up. someone who, who, who isn't controlled by me, but, but, but by a thought, uh, I want... I, I want Ember to- <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> he <Holy> remembered! <laughs> I want Ember to uh, fly in and use uh, Sting uh, on- uh, You hit it! Uh, Ember, Ember flies out of your pack and just rams forward into the chest, biting and gnawing at it, and it lays slain. Oh. All of the mimics are dead. Good Hell job, yeah. team. First Ember room. save the day. <laughs> 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 I'm just, I'm just patting, I'm patting Ember and feeding, feeding him a treat. He deserves it. I'm eyeing him carefully. <laughs> this is why he doesn't come out that often. <laughs> too scared of brick. That's reasonable. Continental breakfast at any time. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Stop. <laughs> okay. Um. Everybody, roll perception for oh, me. Fuck's sake! We're gonna I rolled die. I roll a twenty-three. A nat twenty. Twenty. Two. What the fuck? Earl, fourteen. Eight. Me and Brick see everything. <laughs> okay. I um, see everything. Kenick with the higher score. Um, both nat twenties. I'm gonna go abide by the better mod modifier. Um, you see first. Uh, the chest. Uh, as it kind of withers away. Um, and the blood kind of splorches all over the ground. Uh, you see an egg. Describe the egg to me. It's brown uh, with white, like, like, uh, it's, it's like a light tan brown with uh, eggshell cream white stripes covering it. Okay, I, I'm gonna... I raise my weapon to destroy no, it. I, I, I pick it up, I pick it up, I pick it up, I pick it up, I saw it first, I pick it up. <laughs> I pick it up and I, I, I hold it safely away from Brick. <laughs> what the fuck is that, Kenick? It's an egg. What do you, what do you, what do you want? <laughs> what kind of egg? Where'd you get it? What? I don't know, I'm gonna what? figure that out. God says he wants me to identify it for us. Roll, surely rolls deception. <laughs> Why do you can't just say that? <laughs> it could be true. <laughs> Roll nine deception. <laughs> yeah, fucking no way. Um, <laughs> I'm rolling out Connor on the egg. I rolled a 25. What is, is this? Yeah, egg? it's a. It's a mimic egg. It's, a mimic it's not egg. a mimic that is pretending to be an egg. It is a. It is an unborn mimic. Ooh. Oh my god! Give Maybe it to Brick. Killed a mother. Can, give it to Brick. Keep it? No, can give it to Brick. Do you know I start. I start it? trying to wrestle it out of Kinnick's hands. We're giving it to Brick. Brick, do you know how much these are worth? I start wrestling it as well. Can we keep it? I want to keep it as a pet. Uh, can we train mimics? I'm sure we can train it. I'll. I'll I promise I'll feed it and change its uh, litter box. Oh my god. Do you know what mimics expunge? Only bones. That'll be easy to pick up. <laughs> we could just cook it. No! Brick does look hungry. Brick, if I give you this egg, will you stop looking at him? <laughs> you said it's a mimic egg. They're not, a. Uh, I don't think they're very edible. I mean, there's only one way to find out, I guess. That's 
almost oh, categorically. I'll keep true. a watch over it for now. Okay. I'll knowing he's lying, <laughs> I pass it to Brick anyway. I I put it in my bag. Oh. Oh. And I right. fucking smash it the side of the wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I rolled 20 to strength. <laughs> Uh, peeking inside your bag, you can see uh, the remains of eggshell and wood splinters, almost as if the mimic no! was going, almost as if the mimic was going to take the form of a chair. <laughs> Why did you do that? God told him he had to. Sad machine. <laughs> There's no danger now. There's no God. <laughs> Is there anything like left behind by the chest other than the egg? No. Just that. Was that was it. the reward. That was the reward. Okay. Cool. <laughs> there is no god that would let this happen. So, how much total damage did we all take for that? Egg? I have like ten 30, health right now. Like thirty damage total for a egg we didn't use. You well, you broke it. You didn't. Have I didn't to break, break it. it. No, I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to Mandy. It it could be alive. It's not. Open the bag and tear at it. It's not alive. Oh. All right. It's probably not alive. I guess. Oh. Bird, you're the most dexterous of us all. Um, Bird is in the corner hitting himself in the head, glaring and glaring at it, the ground. I'm not, I don't <laughs> want to talk right now. I got some shit going on. I look at Kenick with my swollen face full of pain. Can you hear this? I look this? away. It's very disturbing. Uh-uh. I... <laughs> I mean, I can't. I don't have any healing spells, but I could cast invisibility on you, so we don't have to look at you. Oh. <laughs> does Brick not have lay of hands? Nope. I, oh, I wait, do. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, wait, yeah, Brick does. <laughs> you're, you're, you're fucking you're, evil. You're looking at the wrong person, <laughs> Sad Machine. Why would you look Sad at the guy machine. who shoots fire out of his hands? <laughs> Closest person. I walk back through into I look the main at chamber. Man, I, I look at I look at Brick House with my swollen, fucked up face. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Hell. <sighs> All right. I, I grip his face in my hands. <laughs> I, I scream loudly as the healing magic restores him. <laughs> <laughs> How much was that? How much you missing? Oh, dude, I'm missing a lot. I'm missing like uh, 16. You you restore 16. Oh hey, shit! How many times can you powerful? use? How many times can you use lay of hands as well? I'm I'm also. Uh, it's five five points times paladin level of healing. Okay. Oh, that's. But like, so I've that's got a lot. I've got nine left. I'm missing more than nine health. <laughs> what you should have you should have looked at him with your fucked up eyes. I don't have fucked up eyes. I got a hurt shoulder and arm. I'm feeling way better, face. thanks. I'm still handsome as fuck. How many, how many points of a hurt arm do you think you'd have if you could put a number on it? <laughs> uh, well, it would use more than all of your nine, so just use nine, I guess. You could take the rest of my healing. Yeah. I, I, I grab his fucking shoulder and I heal him. Sweet. So that's nine points, still, right? Like, stuck in the corner between you while this is happening. I don't like this. I'm going to shuffle out of the room. <laughs> <He's> just, <laughs> Bird is just looking at us, like, at each other, just like fucking shh. No, He's just I, 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 I quietly shuffle face. out of the room through the door into the room with Sad Machine. <laughs> hey, Sad Machine. Hi. What do we do now? Uh, Brad, do you reckon you can make it through those X's? There's another fucking door on the other side of the chamber, can it? That we can't open. Can we not? Uh, yeah, the not? door on the other side of the chamber is uh, there is no obvious lock. It is just sealed. Uh, it's a, it's an iron wrought door, and in the center of it are three smooth grooves where you could probably put three uh, orbs or eggs, maybe. Oh, wait! I have an eggs. idea. I have an idea. Eggs in the hole. Uh, do I still have my life stone? I do. Do we still have? I have the orbs blue from the desert. The, I have the blue life stone from the desert. I turn the mimic bag inside out and start pushing it out like pizza dough into the orb slots. I do <laughs> the same for the middle part. You hear a almost like a Windows error tone, just a <laughs> and, it, and it spits it spits <laughs> the, the, the <laughs> viscous matter of the mimic out as well as the life stone. Oh, I guess it didn't like that. 
I put my spaghetti bag in it. It spits it out with an <laughs> All right, bird, oh. air waiting time. <sighs> Fuck me. I put my hand in it? And it spits you out <laughs> halfway across the room. <laughs> with ah! <laughs> Take five damage. <laughs> Take two damage. <laughs> Ow! God damn it. I just like, I'm leaning against the, the wall with my, my arms folded, just tapping my foot, looking at Bird. <laughs> I like motion that I'm looking at a watch. <sighs> this is payback for me. This is somehow you getting payback on me for being the one who got the sword. <laughs> Kenick. Kenick. What? What if you use the ember to pull the lever down over there? Ember is tiny and does does not have the same strength that a mage hand does. If the mage hand doesn't work, ember won't work. You don't know that. Don't it know might just that. have to be alive. I'm not risking it either. He I'm just not saved risking our lives. it either. You're, why don't you're you're he saved fine. your life. Calm down. Our life. Why don't you... <laughs> I feel can fine. I use, can you well, if you feel fine, you, I, I reckon you can make it through the axis. How much damage clear. did Ember take? Um, Ember didn't take damage. Can it? Can you use? Talk to your friend. No. Why? Why would I want to bring him out last again? Time. He helped us last time. I hate him. <laughs> That's not how you should talk to friends. I hate him. So you should send him into the axe trap. He's not gonna do that for me. He doesn't do, do anything for me. Kenneth, you hear a whispering in your mind. I can do it for you. Shut the right fuck up! <laughs> 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 uh, uh, we're fucked. <sighs> Fine, okay. I walk up to the axes. I take a deep breath. Oh my god. Wait, what's your dex? <sighs> It'd be acrobatics. It'd be, It'd be acrobatics. acrobatics. That worked really well earlier. What's your wait? What's your acrobatics? It's high. He's got a high dick. Before I attempt to dance my way through the axes, <laughs> I would like to roll perception to count the to count the timing and rhythm of the axe swings, and I'm using my inspiration. Ooh. Oh, 17. Damn. Okay. Yep. You have gotten advantage on that, and now you have advantage on your acrobatics throw. Okay. I leap. And, tr and attempt to dance my way through this hallway to the lever and roll a 22. You expertly pass through each blade and reach the lever at the end of the hallway. I yank it down. The blades stop, they go ka-chunk, and they slide back into the wall. A door is now in front of you. Great. I uh, walk down the hallway and golf clap to bird. <laughs> <laughs> Sad Machine sees Kenick do it, and he does it too. <laughs> oh, you guys are playing with fire right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the only one here who didn't take damage that fight. Yeah, but I've been healed. I am going to, uh, I'm going to pull Kenick and, and move past him in the hallway so that he is ahead of me. And I'm going to say, all right, big guy, open the door for us then. Um, I timidly walk up to the door. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Uh, is, is there a handle in my what kind of house? Yeah, it's just a simple wooden door. Yeah, I just, uh, I guess I just reach out and open it up. Okay, inside <laughs> of oh the room God. are- <laughs> you, literally reveal, you literally reveal that there's like five motherfuckers on the other side of the door. <laughs> inside of the room, as the door opens, there are five skeletons standing erratically throughout the room. Uh, and as you open the door, their eyes glow green and they start to activate. Maybe uh, they're friendly. The the skeleton that is up front heads up to you and it uh, adjusts its neck. It is wearing a hat. The others are not. Uh, it, almost, it, you, it almost goes like... It looks at you and it says, Why are you here? Um, hi. Compliment attack. <laughs> Uh, okay. It's speaking my language. That's good. Is, wait, is it speaking common? Can we all hear it? Yep. Um, what? Hello, mister. Hey, let me answer your question with a question. What are you doing here? <laughs> <laughs> I Kenneth, am the light bringer. You're the, shut up, you're, shut up. <laughs> wait, I'm that, the light bringer. That's out of character, I assume. That's out of character, yeah. Yeah, what, what's, uh... What's, uh, 
Or I may, what are you, may have taken a wrong turn. Uh, what are you guys doing here? I just want to know I'm in the right place, you know? This is where all great magics are held. This is the great ziggurat of pain, suffering, and torment. That doesn't look fun at all. Nice hat. Um, do you, do you think you could uh, help us? We're looking for some some people who might have come in here uh, um, not a, against their own will, potentially. If you don't turn back now, you will die. Um, wh why is that? Because we'll kill you. Roll for initiative. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled a 20. Roll a 23. Out of 13. Fuck, you rolled well. That's the master. He's the one with the hat. By the way, I wanted to ask, what hat is it? It's like a it's like a leather tunic. It's like a big pointy leather tunic. Like a like a not like a tunic, but like you know the a big pointy peasant a... like guard hat with oh. like the steel on top and then the leather like uh, yeah, you yeah, know yeah. how it looks like one of the floppy hats, yeah. 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 I go first. Yes. All right. Well, emboldened by the axe swinging shenanigans, Bird cracks his neck back and forth and then he's going to try and he's going to run past Sad machine. Oh, he's first. He's going to cast disengage, or he's going to uh, disengage for with a bonus action. So I don't. My movement doesn't provoke any attack of opportunity. And I am going to run past Kinnick and zip past all of these skeleton boys into this corner here, so that Kinnick can still use his fire hands. And I am going to attempt a rapier strike on one of the skeletons. Okay, sounds good. I roll a crit fail. <laughs> yeah, that is a miss. Your rapier pisses, pisses. Your rapier passes through its rib bones and does not hit it at all. Great. I end my turn. Okay. Uh, the skeleton captain. How I should. Oh, sorry. <laughs> the skeleton captain moves forward towards Kenick and swings its blade, missing. Thank fucking God. It is now Sad Machine's turn. Swarm time question mark, I guess? I don't know. I, I can't really do anything because there's people right in front of me. Yeah, that's true. You're kind of stuck right there in the corridor. I'm going to haggle the DM. Haggle with DM. If I, like, take my bow and put it over Kenick's shoulder and I roll at a disadvantage, can I do that? You can just fire over Kenick, yeah. I don't trust myself firing. Ah! I trust myself firing over Kevin. Okay, actually, now I think about it. You know what? Yeah, I'm doing yeah, that. Yeah, the corridor the corridor is spacey enough to where you can fire to the left or right of him. Um, as long oh, as, okay, uh, okay. As long as you don't get a crit fail, like, you'll be good. <laughs> Imagine getting a crit fail. You better hope I roll well. All right, I use my longbow and I do that then. Also, I would like to mention that I'm going to agitate the... Uh, uh, and I rolled a 22. And I agitate my swarm for an extra one damage. And I'm gonna do my second attack with the longbow. That's a 10, so that doesn't hit, I don't think. Yep, first attack would hit. Seven damage, the second attack does not hit. Alrighty, and now it's Brick's turn. I am going to try and throw a javelin. Oh, God. Pass, <laughs> pass that machine connect directly into the skeleton. Javelin Roll. through two people, rolling a disadvantage. I'm this ready. This is not good. This is bad. 18 and 12. Yeah. It'd be rolling a dis it'd be rolling a disadvantage, so it'd be 12 and 13. They both hit them. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, right. oh god. Five, Dude. Damn. I'm gonna throw another one. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh shit. Oh boy. Well it's it wasn't a, a crit fail. Uh one does not hit. So I've I've hit it a javelin. Okay. It's Brick's turns. Kenick, it's now your turn. I'm gonna use burning hands. Uh, fuck. <laughs> Nine so damage. No, um, they are all alight in fire as the flames burst from your oh, hand. Maybe I should. Oh fuck! Did I roll that? I only rolled that with a level one spell slot, but I. Yeah, you need to use higher level fuck. spell slot. Um, honestly, using a higher level spell slot, they're dead. All three of them are dead. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Even with a minimum amount of damage, they'd be so incredibly close, and you would have to roll like one or two ones, so they are all three dead. Cool. There are only two skeletons that are left. Um, and Turned to a crisp. One of them is this one right here. It's gonna attack Bird. And it misses. The one on the corner. This one is gonna position itself over here. 
And it is going to fire a, an arrow at Kennick. And it misses. Skidding off of the side of the corridor and falling to the ground. It is now Bird's turn. I would like to attack the man who just hit, attempted to hit me with my rapier. Hell yeah. Roll a 20. Ooh. Yeah, uh, your rapier 30, 20. does an incredible amount of damage to it. Uh, it is bloodied, but somehow still standing. Great. I cast disengage and I walk out of the room. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> it's the walk of All right. shame. And Sad Machine, it is now your turn. Uh, right. Sad Machine stares down the guy who tried to... Did Was he trying to hit an arrow at Kennick? Yeah. Yeah, it's, he stares it down... And he says, absolutely nothing. He just attacks with his weapons. hi -yah! <laughs> I do a 21 with nine piercing. And I use 1d6 for swarm time. And I do a one. So it's 10 damage. Okay. He's still standing. But I'm not done yet because I do another attack. It's a 17. hi -yah! Seven piercing. Okay, he is dead. That is another skeleton dead. How do we? How are we even killing these skeletons? Wait, They're just skeletons. Is the hat one still alive? No, no there, there's one left okay. in the in the left side of the room, just sitting there, going like, "Oh can it, fuck!" It can speak. <laughs> no, it's just it's just like looking at itself, and you can just hear like teeth clacking. So it sounds. Mm. Oh my god! Uh, it is now Brick's turn. Although I don't think Brick could hit that one from where they are. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I'm skipping my turn. I don't want to try and barrel through this clown show. <laughs> it's a very <laughs> narrow hallway. All right, Kenneth, it is now your turn. Not my turn. Um, yep. I want to call out to the last remaining skeleton and tell it to give up and lay down its hands. It's 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 hands. It's ar arms. Wait, weapons. Okay, roll intimidation. Twenty one. Fuck. Okay. Um. Uh, you're the last one left. It's over. Put down your weapons and leave. <laughs> Where's it gonna leave? Past us, I guess. Okay, uh, the skeleton gives up, drops its sword, goes and stands in the corner with its face against the wall shaking. Nice. Um, on the skeleton captain, uh, you can see Kennick, since you're right there in front, you can see clearly there is a small red orb and a key. Ooh, I, uh, I'll pick, pick both of those up then. The red orb and the key. Sad machine goes to the scared skeleton. <laughs> oh God, it's gonna become a therapist. Are you okay? It just clacks at you. I touch, I touch his shoulder, bone. He turns around, tilts his head, turns back around and clacks at you. I think he needs time. I enter the skeleton room. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> I loom over it, but I just oh watch Sad Machine interact with it. <laughs> can you talk, can you talk a uh, common question mark? Smile? It shakes its head and clacks at you. And turns back around to face the corner. Shakes head yes or no? No, shakes head no. Nods is yes. Shakes so you understood no. me then. Oh god. It nods. Oh I walk into the room and I stab the skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> it falls to the ground dead. <laughs> Bird! Sad machine! Bird! It was already dead, sad machine. It's a skeleton. <laughs> what kind of life could he live? Clacking in the corner? Would you want a life of clacking in the corner? I don't want a life clacking in the corner. <laughs> I really don't okay. In the room, uh, you found a red ball and a key. Um, in front of you, there is another iron wrought door. However, there are no surfaces. There are no locks. Uh, and to your right, there is a corridor leading right and then up. Mm. I want to go head back down to the uh, other other door down here. Um, the the one mm -hmm. of the, the things. And I want to see if I can put the red orb into one of these slots. Let's see what happens. Yep. You put it into a slot and it just... And it clicks like it's locked in. Nice. Uh, I'd like... While he does that... While he does that? While he does that. While he does that. <laughs> I go in the hallway. Is there anything in the hallway? It's uh, literally just a room? It's a hallway uh, leading towards uh, this door here. Okay. The Does the door have anything on it? It's just a normal door? Just a simple door with a lock. Okay. If I roll stealth, can I just peek? Oh, uh, it's locked. Oh. I go back to everybody and I say... The door in the hallway is locked. All right, get out of the way. I would like to walk through the hallway up to the door, and I would like to use my thieves' tools and roll stealth to try and peek into the room. Okay. Well, I while this is happening, I walk back into this one and uh, tell Brick that I thieves' uh, tools. I rolled a crit fail. I suck. Yep, the lock pick breaks in the lock. 
Oh, having, that sucks. I'm having a bad day. I've taken no damage and I'm still having a bad day. I, tr I feebly fine. try and look through the keyhole. Ah, uh, you can see the broken remains of your lockpick stuck in the keyhole. <laughs> That's about what I expected. I tap, sad machine taps bird's back, says, It's all right, we can get you new tools. tools I still have a few tools. tools. My soul, my spirit is just broken. We could fix it. I've stepped up and walked past sad machine. <laughs> <laughs> Kenick, Kenick, remind me what you found. I found a key and a red orb. <laughs> yep. All right. Just wanted to make that like pretty clear. Okay. Uh, all right. So I put the red orb in the other one. I can. We can use this key on oh, that. Oh, we're uh, morons. We can use that key on the, that other door in the hallway. <laughs> can you even open it now that the lock is broken? Wait, lock what? Pick broke. <laughs> The lock it's just broken? a lockpick. Yeah, no, it's fine. Wait, what There's the no. fuck did you guys do? It's not broken inside the- I can fish <laughs> it out! You didn't wait? Why I, would I? You were out doing some gay shit! I was putting the orb in the door for <laughs> safekeeping. I don't want to fucking lug it around. Jesus oh, Christ. Oh no. I, yeah. I, I see- I see <laughs> Brick going see past Brick. me. Oh, oh no. Let me look at this. I'm like- Brick is at the door. I roll strength to try and smash the door down. No! <laughs> I roll strength. I roll uh, you, you, you thunder through the door, breaking it completely, splitting it in half into the next <laughs> room, like where right you find a series of, it is a black uh, stone room with orange gems once again lining every wall. In the centerpiece is a pillar uh, and there is an orb on top of the pillar in what seems to be a magical crystal case. Uh, oh. There is a small button underneath the, uh, right in the, the front facing side of the pillar. I go into the, uh, can, I don't want to move past anybody actually. <laughs> Were you about to walk into the room and just press the button? <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. Thanks. <laughs> um, well, break your in front of everybody and just smash through the door. I don't understand this room. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yes, we all go in the room yeah, then. I'm walking in and I'm going to roll Arcana. On the, I rolled a 21. What do I know yep, about You can tell that the... The orb is uh, similar to the red orb. Uh, the crystal case is uh, basically unbreakable unless you were a fucking magic savant. And the button is simply mechanical in nature. Hmm. This room is pretty. Um, what are what are the, the circles on the ground that I... Those are just pillars in the middle of the room that uh, look like the other pillar that are just rising into the air and touching the ceiling. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, there are other doors in this room? Or is it just... All right, there is a, an iron rot door similar to the one in the skeleton room. It's smooth. And then there is a simple wooden door right here. Hmm. I touch the orb. Do you touch the orb or the button? Yeah, the orb. The orb, you you don't, There, it's covered in a crystal like casing. So you touch the casing. Oh, I, I didn't know it was in a casing. Never mind. Yes. I look at the button. I look at Kanek. I look at the button again. Don't, just, just wait. I'll let you press it. I look at the button. I think we can press it. Just fucking wait. Jesus. Okay. I'm gonna go over to the wooden door. Okay. Um, is there a keyhole, anything? Is it locked? Unlocked? Ah, uh, no, it is unlocked. <sighs> I mean, okay, I'm going to slowly open this door. <laughs> to just, 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 okay. just a crack. Just speak. So I can see through and see what's on the other side. Uh, it is just another simple flooded corridor. Uh, with a door on the flooded? left side. Yeah, it's 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 flooded. There's it looks like, like it's water? leaking out of the door in the right here, uh, down the corridor. On the uh, right of the, okay. Yep, yeah, yeah. and then there is a door in front. So it is just a simple corridor with three doors down that way. I want to pick up a stone and throw it down the hallway at the water. Okay, the stone lands in the middle of the water and just bobs on the surface of the water. That's some dense okay. water. That is dense fucking water. It's a, or it's a really light stone. Shut up. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, I would like to right. walk up and I would like to inspect the uh, the button. Okay. Um, your knowledge of uh, traps and uh, your your mechanical knowledge, uh, you can tell that it's just a simple mechanical button. Um, it does not feel like it. Uh, you you can't really tell, but you get the feeling that it doesn't lead towards anything else in the room, that it's situated only at this pillar. Okay. I am going to 
say, I think Sad Machine's good to press the button and then take a few steps back. Yeah, all right. Let's get it over with. And I like lean against one of the pillows. Sad Machine with immeasurable glee presses the button. A kashunk and a part of the pillar opens up, revealing four uh, old sheets of paper. One for each, presuming, of the party here. Uh, do not check your Discord DMs. Ignore them right now. Okay. All right. I am set. You are, as you pick up each piece of paper, you each. Uh, I don't know if anybody remembers this, but Sad Machine can't read. Oh, God. Give me your piece of paper, Sad Machine. <laughs> As you each take a piece of paper, you see on the back side of it, it says, this is a simple puzzle, but a time is required. You must complete this puzzle within five minutes and slot it back into the pillar and you will receive your prize. Everybody look at their, your Discord DMs. Okay. okay. Can it? I oh. have, uh, say? I have Wait. part of a maze. I, yep, I also have, I also have I also part of a maze. maze. I I think I have a um, maze. All right, I'm open. I don't have Photoshop downloaded. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you do you have MS Paint? Yeah, I think I do. I filled MS Paint in, and it's it's all red. <laughs> don't use a fill. Use a pencil. <laughs> uh, uh, a piece of charcoal is so provided wait. for each of you. Okay. Do you we have, start at the bottom. You will start at the bottom. Let me know when everybody has paint up. Do not start until uh, I start. You have five minutes. I'm going to be honest. But, I already solved it. Oh, Shut my God. Up. I'm so, well, you didn't am, say am it. I starting, I, am I, I starting from the bottom or the top? You're starting at the bottom. I already solved it. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're starting. David's a savant, apparently. I'm sorry, but I, you, you, <laughs> you probably just gave you me the easy didn't one, right? Yeah. I, 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 had, I had four of varying difficulty, right, and I, I set it. them randomly. This okay. one is really easy, yeah. Right. Oh, wait, do I need to send the, the Send solve? the completion, yeah, back oh, okay. to me. Okay, because I did it without... I just looked at it and I knew. Wait, well, I right-clicked and it disappeared. Wait, control Z? And it comes back? No, what the fuck? It's going to be it's gonna be weird to edit, make into a audio Yeah, I, I am so haste, my, my I hastily maze. scribble a line almost straight down the maze. All right, I'm done. You gave us five minutes for that? Yeah, I was gonna give you like two minutes, but I didn't know how hard it would be. If I was, if we were in person, I would just hand them to you. Brendan, it's literally it's like, like a, a straight, straight line, line for yeah. me. I, I went through and I looked at them and there were four of varying difficulty, okay. okay? I'm sending it in perilous chat. It's literally a straight line. Um, yeah, yeah, I just, I went through and there were varying difficulty. <laughs> I if you really... I even have the solution saved here for them. Did you guys send the fucking... Oh, wow, I can't believe we're going to send this as a Patreon exclusive. <laughs> <laughs> the solved puzzles. Can you solve these puzzles? <laughs> oh, I thought it'd be really funny to just have a very shitty puzzle. <laughs> That was fun. Like a fucking kids menu. Uh, the crystalline st structure, Kashunks, and the blue orb is now available for the taking. Uh, you I have the blue orb. The you blue have orb. taken two of the three blue orbs, and yet more of the dungeon awaits. You don't know what other horrible, horrible horrors are going to be within the ziggurat of pain, sorrow, and torment. But you can't wait to find out if it's a little bit perilous. Thanks so much for listening. A huge thank you to all our top patrons, such as... I forgot to even open Patreon to check what the names of the people are. Gimme a minute! Air 109, Alan Diver, Alex Steer, Ben Krismanic, Bike, Bongo Crust, Boopoo Lu, Cap Z, Clayotic, Daxter092, Desrick Gothroy, Ducky Madness, Eric Scott Gillies, Fang Jade, Generic Phoenix, Harry Norris, Inverted Van Man, It's Abby's. Jeff Smith, Kobe, Manuel Martinez, Mellow Wolf, Maya, Notoriety, Pyropat, Schizolingvo, Seawolf812, Snake Asylum, Teague, Travis Fapes, Trevor Wood, William Oliver, Winchester Curse, and Zora Curol. Thanks so much for listening, and we'll see you soon.
Yeah. That was yeah. Fucking that ending puzzle was a bit. Yeah. <laughs> that is, that that is, that is such weird. a weak thing to end the episode on. Oh, that's so funny. That's, that's gonna so be imp- also <laughs> impossible to make good in an audio format. Oh, I'm not <laughs> gonna, I'm I'm gonna, gonna, what gonna do. Format, though. All right. <laughs> Yeah. So, so David, this is what you're gonna do. You're going to screen record you completing all of these puzzles and have them layered oh, over God. the top of each other on the video, and just like yeah, I could I could do that. <laughs> I can do that. I mean, it's not like it's gonna take long, Brendan. Just shut up! <laughs> Why you gotta be me? I, I legitimately Let's spent clap. three manic hours working on this shit. And you're just like, oh, Brendan, fuck off. No, that's not what I'm saying. What? What I'm oh, saying Brendan, is, this is, it's I'm, not gonna work on in audio though. That's the it, thing. It's, it's a fucking it doesn't matter. Look at fucking all the motherfuckers who make goddamn D and D podcasts that do physical <laughs> puzzles that you can't see. They can fucking use their imagination. <laughs> should we? Uh, I don't give a shit. We, oh good, I don't have a brain okay. in my head. Should we clap? This is should part we, of the we, episode we, now. Holy good, shit! Good, keep it. Let's clap. Let's clap. Let's clap. Let's clap. <laughs>